been a long time. I shouldn't left you without a video to watch you. What's up, YouTube fam? I'm Shannon, and I am an artist, designer, librarian, foodie, and lover of all things Black. Come along with me as I travel to new places, eat new food, try new things, eat some more food, highlight Black-owned businesses, and all other matters of carrying on. Be sure to subscribe, like, and comment. Welcome to the channel. What's up, y'all? Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another travel vlog. As you can see by the title, I am getting ready to go to Aruba. So yeah, headed to Aruba in the morning. I switched it up on you guys this time. I'm coming to you um, the night before my trip because I got to be up and out of here super duper early in the morning. I feel like I'm just going to be worried about getting out the door. So I said, let me just do my intro tonight. But yeah, headed to Aruba tomorrow. Um, it's my aunt's birthday. So this is a, a birthday trip. It's also a family trip. We're all related. It's also a girl's trip because it's all ladies. So yes, this is what... Blah, 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 blah. This will be all of our first time um, in Aruba, so looking forward to it. Um, it's about going on 11 o'clock right now, so um, I just hopped out the shower. Pretty much all packed, just got a couple of things to throw in my bag once they dry. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go in here, try to get a few hours of shut eye, and I'll holler at y'all in the morning. Peace. What's up, y'all? I'm here at the airport, super duper early. It only took me like five minutes from the time I walked into the door, walked into the door to go through security. So now I'm just here waiting. So here we are, landed in Aruba. This is a look at the airport. And then right outside the airport, um, we were on a kind of like a charter bus that was taking folks from the airport to the different resorts in the area. So this is a look at um, what the area looks like from the airport to the resort. And here we are arriving at our resort. We stayed at the Ryu Palace Antijas, which is an adults resort. And then right next door is the sister resort, the Ryu Palace Aruba, which is for families. Ocean front. Room tour. Yeah, right here. I already Room tour. Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. I already claimed my bed. <laughs> it's an ocean view, not ocean front. You can see a piece of it. I'm about to call and see what's on the pool club. Now, while I go to the pool, I want you to come here. What's all this? What's all in there? Closet and um, robes, blankets, blanket, seat. So after checking in, we, you know, started exploring the resort to see what they had to offer. This is the courtyard area that eventually leads to the pools and beaches. And now we're walking to the sister resort. So this is the pool in between the two. And then this is Ryu Aruba. This is us headed to the dining hall um, at the Rio Aruba side. Overall, the food at the resort was pretty good. I'd say, I'd say it was like an eight out of ten. You know, it was it was expectable for resort food, but they did have a lot of variety and everything was pretty good overall. Now, what would a resort vacation be without the nightly entertainment? <laughs> And 
after that, we headed to the disco tech. <laughs> So y'all, this is day two in Aruba, uh, just waking up, sitting out on the patio. The only downside is they were doing construction right next to us. So this is actually why I'm voicing over this part because y'all weren't going to be able to hear anything I was actually saying. And this is a look at it. I guess they were building a resort next door. <laughs> I hope you all enjoyed that little interlude. Um, here we are eating breakfast at the dining hall on our side. And then after breakfast, we headed to the beach. Swear Lord, it's hot. We're making our way down to the water. Look up, Aunt Shine. <laughs> <laughs> And as you can see, that beach was packed. Um, I believe they were having some type of, I don't know, aerobics class or something in the water. You know how they have those group classes at the resort. And as you can see, my Aunt Sharon is disabled, but she was determined to get in that water. And guess what? We did and did. We got down to that water. We actually met some nice folks you see in the background here um, from the same area in the States that we're from, and they helped her as well. <laughs> She wants to float on her stomach now. Uh, <laughs> she wants to float on her stomach now, Candace. I don't think so. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Hold her up. Hold her up. Oh, my God. 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 Oh, my Shades darker. 
but yes great time at the pool and beach today the water here i think it has a high salt quantity because when i tell you buoyancy you don't even have to do nothing and you'll float in that water it's so easy to float in it so i think it's pretty salty um but that it was so good though so good to chill and ride the wave got my shirt up in the water now i'm watching them down on the pool deck they about to do the wobble of course because what is it if the wobble is not played they just finished doing the cupid shuffle and here we are headed to my aunt sharon's birthday dinner it's at the steakhouse on the resort and you do have to make reservations we got her we got her <laughs> 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 birthday dinner! Happy birthday, Ashen! And the food at the steakhouse, it was okay. Um, you know, a lot of times that's how it be. Like the fancier places, the food be lackluster. Um, to be honest, I probably could have been good with the buffet, but it was still cool. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. My aunt wanted to go to the disco because she did not go with us the night before. But as you can see, it was pretty empty because it was still early. Back hurts. Bottom, bottom of my back. My hip bone. I ain't touching nothing. Oh. Ugh, running start. Hey, Sharon. Hey, Sharon. Hey, Sharon. Hey, Sharon. Hey, Decided to come take a walk down on the beach where everybody is slumbering. So, yeah, come walk on the beach with me. So, as you can see, this is a stark contrast to the day before at the beach. So, if you want that nice, quiet, peaceful time, definitely go early in the morning. This was around seven or eight, I believe. All right, shoes are off. Cozies are in the water. It's so beautiful out here. Oh yeah, let me turn that way. Touch my light. Hey, come on, light. Come on, light. Okay. Let me snap a couple pictures out here. And here's us on a shuttle on our way into town to the mall and little shopping areas. Um, this is the area where the cruise ships um, port. Is that the right word? I don't know. But anyway, this is where the cruise ships pull up. Um, so there's lots of shopping um, souvenirs wise, uh, luxury shopping wise in this area.
back to the resort where they were having a pool party. <laughs> headed to dinner they actually had um a live performer in the dining hall this night and then after we headed to the entertainment hall <laughs> and here we are headed to the airport i definitely recommend aruba if you haven't visited i would definitely make a return trip um I, if i would go back i would probably stay off the resort or get off the resort a little bit more to learn more about the culture and people of aruba y'all know that's what i love to do when i travel but overall it was a great trip thank you for watching as always and be sure to like share and subscribe